original song. Um, like I said, years. Um, I'll start one when I was like 13, and then I'll just I'll think, hey, you know what? That's a cool riff. You know, I'm gonna use it for this. I'm gonna put these lyrics over it. And it, there's really no set time. I mean, I still got songs in that book that I can't figure out what to do with, but it's not time yet. You know, everything. The songs will write themselves. Really, when it's time, you'll come across it, and it'll it'll all fall into place. You'll see. Um, let me see here. I have trouble finishing my own songs. How do you write yours and finish them? Any advice? Um, like I said, whatever you do, write it down, tab it out, because eventually you're going to wake up one night and you're going to be like, boom, this just fits perfect. I just need to remember what tab I did this long time ago and how I played it, because I want that sound back. If you can remember that, you're going to be aces. Um, finishing the songs. Lyrics take a long time, but they usually are stuff you already know. Lyrics are usually stuff you just got to admit to yourself, you know, like, oh, okay, this is what happened. You know, I'm very open. I'm a very honest, open person, and what I write is pretty much what's happened to me. You know, I mean, I'm sure you hear some stuff and it sounds like, well, that's kind of jacked up. It's true, though. You know, I got to admit that stuff to myself before I can do anything else, before I can actually put it away in the vault and be like, okay, I don't need to worry about that anymore because that's already out. It's like therapy. That sounds weird, but I'm saving a lot of money. <laughs> um, where do you get to have to already answered that one. Let me see. Do you name your guitars? No. I guess I should. But I don't like thinking of them as people because it's kind of creepy just putting my hands all over them. No, nah, I don't name my guitars. Um, most of your songs have sad words. Are you on medication? I probably should be. No, I'm just kidding. I'm a really happy person. I go out and I have fun. I'm very lively. I'm not very shy or quiet. Um, but they have sad words because, like I said, they're therapy, you know, I get a lot of that stuff out. I mean, it kind of sucks, too, when friends know about my music because when I play something, they always come back and they're like, was that about me? Or are you mad at me? Or, you know, I used to date this girl. It was like all the time. It was like, oh, that's about me, right? Or what are you trying to say? Or is that a backhanded comment? It's, it's not. It's not. It's just stuff I got to get out from me. You know, if you like it, you like it. If you don't, turn it off. I mean, there's just hit the X up in the corner and close it out or something, you know, don't let it load, I don't care, I mean, I'm not trying to hurt anybody's feelings, but I'm not gonna not say what I want to say either, you know, that's not fair, but I don't know, but no, I'm not on medication, I mean, I take a lot, I take creatine, but I don't, not like anything else. Um, what's your favorite movie? Dumb and Dumber. I don't anything to say anything else, because I think it's an awesome movie. I want to learn the Mockingbird song. What's your favorite drink? Um, for taste or purpose? Taste? I enjoy a good pina colada. It's got a good taste to it, but it's not going to get me messed up. Um, favorite drink? Probably absinthe or Everclear or something crazy, you know? I don't know. Um, whatever's on special that night is my favorite drink. <laughs> Do you have any pets or siblings? It's kind of weird that you worded it pets or siblings. That's kind of what you put pets before siblings which I find weird but yes both I do I have um, a brother and a sister and I have four dogs and a cat yeah it's Noah's Ark over here but oh what types of guitars and strings do you use I have a Washburn the black one is a Washburn guitar it uses phosphorus bronze elixir strings boom right there the stuff I don't care how crappy your guitar sounds when you buy it, you put a set of these on there, you're going to get an awesome tone out of it. I don't play on anything else anymore. Electric, acoustic, all that is elixir. I used to use the Steel Blues, which is really good, but, man, you can't beat elixirs. They're expensive, but so worth it. So worth it. Um, the other brown guitar that's not that pretty is um, my friend's guitar. It's a Babylon. I don't know who makes it. Never heard of it before, but I really like the tone on it, so I haven't forced him to take it back yet. <laughs> Um, let me see here. It's 21 questions. Um, anything else you want to know, I guess, just ask. Hopefully that covers a lot of it. Um, I try to answer everybody's emails and comments as I can, but I don't know. I got a lot of stuff I'm doing. I'm actually going to Colorado, too, for about a month. I got a couple more songs, but I'm going to see if I can get a little nicer scenery than here in Texas, because Texas is just whew, it's too hot to be outside. But Colorado, I'm gonna get some. See if I can get some snow shots and stuff. Maybe some cool areas to set up some songs. Um, other than that, I'm still working on the CD. 
I'm um, working on a band too. I got some people interested. We're going to try to get that together. CD, I don't really have a release time yet. Probably looking at another three or four months because I'm a perfectionist when it comes to stuff like that. And this is my studio, like my house is. Because I, I did have a studio and actually went and checked it out. And I just wasn't comfortable. I didn't, I wasn't comfortable. So, you know, if you're not comfortable there, you're not going to be able to, like, talk freely and just, you know, sing right. So, that's not going to work. But this is my studio, you know. This is my microphone. This little thing right here is my microphone. Um, I got programs on the computer I use. Um... You want to see my microphone, my other microphone? Check this out. Dogs barking now, see, so you have to buy a dog. If you're going to write your own music, I think everybody should have one of these. This is just a mic stand with a can taped to the top of it with duct tape, just wrapped around it. I know. it's so retarded looking and I hide it when people come over but listen to the tone you get you get like a really good like acoustics out of it which is why I don't need to play in the bathroom anymore I first started out in the bathroom but that's a really cool trick I like the can on the microphone stand sure it's stupid but can't argue with results um all right well like I said I'm putting up a new song too it's got a slideshow it's kind of a tribute to everybody who's had to put up with my shit but at the end of it is some album art from the new CD, so check it out. Let me know what you think. Other than that, take care. See you there.